Genya really said. Gun breathing, fourth form. Double barrel shotgun. Bro has a gun? I thought this is Demon Slayer. This is where you're supposed to use the swords and, you know, cut the demon's heads off. Bro, shut up with the gun. And it was so out of place. It was so funny. I'm not the first, only one that thought it was that shit was hilarious, right? Okay. But it's got the special gunpowder that, you know, kills off the demon, so it's fine. But Hantengu can reproduce multiple times, which sounds kind of weird. But, you know, his head gets cut off and new forms arrive. Now, Tokito has gotten flown away. I think this means that he's going to be fighting Gyoko away. So, Nezuko, Tanjiro, Genya will have to fight Hantengu. But there's still one more that's left over, right? Where is Mitsuri at? Maybe she'll enter soon. Let's begin today's reaction, though. Good karma. Now, surely this isn't some kind of disturbing foreshadowing. You know, Tokito, like, learns to do good for others, right? He takes in Tanjiro's words, but somehow it actually backfires and gets him killed because he was trying to protect other people. They wouldn't do some shit like that, right? I swear to God, man, because, like, we haven't had a Hashira death since, uh, you know, from the Mugen train. So, you know, Uzui, Tengen Uzui got away safely. Hopefully this arc, everyone survives too, but I feel like... A character death is coming, man. Mist breathing. Show me that mist breathing, baby. Oh. oh I just cut it. <laughs> okay, fine. Don't show me mist breathing. Oh, mister, it's you again. You bullied me in episode two and called me worthless and smacked me, but thank you. Actually, it's not really mister. He's like Tokito super young too, right? They're like pretty much like the same age almost, I think. I don't think he ever heard you say seaweed head, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, like that. <laughs> he didn't have to self-report. Tanjiro, you okay? You okay? No, 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 we survived this one, right? Or was there a cliffhanger? Yeah, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. But like, the, the foot fell down and then the head grew out of it. Are there gonna be more out of this? Huh? Ah. Uh. The same name can keep reproducing. So like, ah, it's a double. Bro, we're, we're taking way too much damage. So like episode four or five. Hmm? Oh, it's not that much damage. Ah, so they have the main four. And then the more they split, it gets weaker. Huh. Gotcha. So then we should just keep cutting it off. Yeah, exactly. Multiple times. But that's the main body. That's still really strong. No, we can't take that. We can't take that. Huh? Behind you? Huh? Oh, it just goes away at a certain point. Okay. It hurts like hell, what do you mean? Fuck off, dude! This is so cheap! He's just flying! We gotta get that sun breathing in, come on. Man, do we have any kind of ranged attacks? Maybe we should do the really cool thing, where we intentionally get hit, and then make him, like, just grab it, and then cut him off then. Huh? What do you get? Oh! One was... I didn't see shit, okay! Go for the head, go for the head. Okay! There we go! Nezuko doing okay? Now, I'm sure Nezuko will be fine. I'm more interested in Genya, though. Okay, remember how he got impaled? But, the previous episode, something about his tooth falling off and coming out. Are they hinting that Genya has some kind of re like really crazy regenerative like powers? Because there's no way Genya's just gonna die off right now, right? And also Nezuko has some crazy regeneration too. But it's still three versus two here. Where is Mitsuri? I really feel like Mitsuri has to show up here. Genya? Are stuck in what though? Is he even injured? Yeah, where's his gun? <laughs> More gun breathing, brother! <laughs> this is amazing. I hope he has enough bullets to last long, though. So he really did get, like, impaled. But, like... That went straight through him. 
Does he really have some kind of crazy regeneration? Come on, tell me you're good, man. Tell me you're good. Genya, you got some secret powers we don't know about? Like, what? No shot. No shot. I don't believe this, man. Oh, I'm gonna choke. Oh. Replay. That's so grotesque. But, like, why would they expl explicitly mention about that tooth falling out and being back in? Like, a joke scene? Like, and then he could stab like this? Or... Oh. I, I don't know, man. I, I I just don't think he's gonna die here. It makes no sense. Look at him. What is he, he's doing something. His mouth is moving. What? what? Huh? Huh? What are you chanting, brother? What? Yo, you, you guys, should you guys let him, you know, chant this shit? Some kind of religious chant? That's interesting, considering they got like a religious theme too. Kenya, come on, Kenya, come on. Huh? Where? Nothing personnel, kid. Yes, I know it's personal, but personnel sounds cooler. Ah, uh, that dude, that AOE lightning man. But hold up, go back. How are you still moving without the with the injury? Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> I don't know why he did that some kind of incantation and now he's fine let's go rip his head off let's go it's fine nah she's fine she's taking way worse it's completely fine oh my god it's a foot through her oh bro that just looks so wrong, man. Let's go take that fucking scroll off. Dude, he is always just so upset. <laughs> the guy with the staff, I mean. Let's go. Oh, right back at you, dude. Oh, shit. His head actually just got kicked off. This isn't full transformation until that scroll comes off, right? Oh, right. She's got the flame property, too. Huh? Oh. Wait, he has the fan! Did she use the fan? Use the fan. Oh no, shot! Use the fan! <laughs> Yeet! I wonder where he's going. Maybe to where Tokito went. Yeah, that's good. Just gonna keep using the fan? No! Oh. Hm. Still fine. No, it should, should be fine. It should be fine. No, she's good. She's good. That's her girl. No, she. Yeah, it's fucking pretty bad. Mitsuri, please. Mitsuri! It's so annoying, man. Like, you know situations like this in video game where there's like a flying opponent. It's like, bro, get the fuck down here and fight me. Ugh. Again, maybe the coolest thing would be like, let him attack you, sink his talons in, and once he thinks he got you, slice his head off. Let him just come down and just, just take the hit. What are you gonna do? <laughs> what did that screech? Yeah! Come on. Nezuko will be fine. Genya, I don't know. He's kind of like a zombie now. What the fuck is going on with him? Like, is he gonna start chanting again? No shot. No. <laughs> like, but how? I need to understand why. What are you saying, bro? Hashira's brother. <laughs> Yo, doesn't it feel like Hunting was getting kind of scared of Genya? <laughs> Look at his face! Huh? Damn. Huh? The name of the man that will kill you? Oh! Oh! <laughs> Look at him posing with the gun! Nice one. Yo, we don't get like, uh, what's his name? Inosuke in this like arc, but Genya kind of fills that wild side, I feel like. Wait, Tanjiro, use your like new, I don't know, reading skills that you got from Yorichi Zero or just run away. Okay. Joestar ultimate technique. Running away always works. Psych! Oh, 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 oh. Yeet! Nice! 
Ah. Oh, right in the back. It's okay. We're in range, though. So now what? We just continue flying until he just falls? Oh! Make him fly back to the location! Smart! Did he actually maneuver him back to where Nezuko and Genya is, though? No shot. Damn! He really did! Tanjiro, giga brain! Yeah, Nezuko looking pretty rough. Though. No, she'll be fine. Our girl's gonna be fine. <laughs> she looks pretty rough right now, though. Let's go! Get that scroll off! Oh, we can just throw another staff out? Oh! Oh! That's the other guy's foot! Lightning resist? Tanjiro really thinking that much ahead? What? Bro, the flying was giga brain enough like this too? Was he always this smart? Bro's a genius. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. They can't fight? Just a bit. Okay, okay. Nice, more lightning. It's just a lightning resistance glove. Ah. Time's run. Time's run out. Come on. Somebody! Mitsuri! Or not, just get hit. That wasn't too bad. That, that wasn't too bad. Wait, somebody, maybe somebody stopped hunting Guzo. Oh, our girl! Let's go. Bite that scroll off. Pocket sand. I mean, pocket flames. Uh huh. Yeah, that shit's come in clutch so many times. Hmm? Oh shit, it's the guy with the fan, though. Dude, when Nezuko used to fan though, that was so sick. Uh. Mitsuri, where are you at? This is the moment when someone comes and saves us. I don't know who it's gonna be, but it feels like it has to be Mitsuri, don't you think? I've been begging for Mitsuri the entire episode, but she still ain't here. What is she doing? Where'd she go? I hope she has a, like a super epic entrance though. Uh, Why is it looking like game over? Dude, that... These faces don't look good. Guys? Genya? Wait, Genya, where are you at? No, 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 no. Here we go, finally! Girl, where have you been? It's okay. The hero always arrives late. She looks so excited. Man, I can't wait to see her fight. I don't think I've seen her fight. In the trailer though, I think her sword actually moves around like um like it's not a linear sword. It's like Renji's sword from Bleach, if you know what I'm talking about. Alright, next episode then. One of my favorite things about Demon Slayer, especially when I noticed during, you know, the uh, Entertainment District Arc, as soon as the Upper Moon show up, the rest of the season is just hype fights back to back to back. Bro, it's only like episode 4, dude. It's gonna get, keep getting better. Mitsuri is finally showing up. Let's see what she can do next episode. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video and check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.